Meet Cavendish Atwell, an 82-year-old entrepreneur from Syndicate Lane, St. Lawrence Gap. He has always had a knack for being innovative. An example of his creativity is the way in which he has been utilizing seaweed for the past four years in his gardens and to sell to others for use as a fertilizer. In retirement, you want to do something. And I, and I used to go down to Bath and so regular and see the amount of moss and things down there. And it reminded me that, you know, something Graham Hall used to send uh, cow carts and so down to Dover Beach, then moss washing and taking it back to Graham Hall. So I you say, you know something, something could be done with this moss. And then I started to work with it. Before the influx of sargassum seaweed on several beaches across the island, Mr. Atwell had been visiting Bath Beach in St. John on a regular basis to collect seaweed for his various projects. According to him, the process of bringing seaweed to fertilizer is a simple one. This is the first phrase of it. Now this year dry out a bit, but then you come off the beach in this, in, in this farm, right? Then, then you get that far, you come over here and, and put through a second drain where the air passes on the, and pull, and pull. see, the wind comes on the here and, and lifts the salt out. You can actually test it with like this, right? And then you get that far, you put it flat down over here, right? Flat down over there. This metal to give it that crisp drying thing, right? And then from there then, you can test, test it with your hand and you could bring it up here. And just run two. You gotta see that relief in it, ain't it? <laughs> huh? Yeah, yeah. Currently, Mr. Atwell sells his products to various supermarkets across the island and also to persons who are involved in backyard gardening. Mr. Atwell believes that Barbadians should see the seaweed as a blessing and is suggesting that government could look into investing in this new venture. I feel that the government should use one of those factories either uh, Portville or the X1 for folk three or four months every year producing not only CV, the seed moss and so that washing all around the country and turn into fertilizer. It's only, it, it is simple, you only have to get started. If they can get the NCC people to rig it up, put it, put it in a bag also and get it there and then it could be worked on you could get it desanded and, and all the same way you get the sand out of it here i'd be willing to show them how you can get the sand out of it and we can mix it with the bagasse you can mix it with the trees from the tambrin and all those uh, evergreen trees that we throw it in the dump right instead of burning outside for fertilizer with the influx of sargassum seaweed expected to continue for some time, Mr. Atwell could be regarded as an example to others of how creativity and entrepreneurship can turn a potential problem into profit. <laughs>